The usage of the line numbers featured in long documents can help readers quickly find specific lines. So how can we add line numbers? Next, I'll show you the effects of setting different line number types. 1. Click the Page Layout tab and the Line Numbers drop-down button. We can see that there are different settings in the list. We can choose the Continuous Reading option to add line numbers to the entire document. 2. Choose Restart Each Page to start with number 1 on each page. 3. Choose Restart Each Section to start with number 1 after each section break. To learn more about the section settings, you're welcome to enter WPS Academy. In addition to the three types of line numbers described above, you can also select both Compress Current Paragraph and Do Not Show Line Number at the same time. Select the content that does not require line numbers, click Compress Current Paragraph to skip the selected content and continue with the number on the next line. If you only want to number lines with content, click Do Not Show Line Number to skip the blank lines to number the next line. Finally, if these still do not meet our needs, we can click Line Number Options in the Line Numbers drop-down list. In the pop-up dialog, we can customize the line number. The starting number can be set in the Start At box. Line number intervals can be set in the Count By box. The position of the line numbers can be set in the From Text box, and the types of numbers can be set in the Numbering area. These can be selected according to our needs. If we want to remove line numbers, click None in the Line Numbers drop-down list. 